I'm not sure any single one of them has shot back so far. <laughs> Perfect timing. Previously on Control. New guns. Uh, fantastic, phenomenal new guns. New enemies. Horrible, fantastical new enemies. Um, new area. Uh, new idioms from Ati. And uh, we, we unclogged a pipe, which was um, quite something. But yeah, um, let's see what the Federal Bureau of Control has in store for us this week. Because I kind of feel like it was a natural place to stop last week uh, as we started to head to parapsychology to find Marshall. But I also feel like, you know when you just like, I stopped and then I was like, I wonder if we were about to have a big old moment there. Astral constructs. We've got another new app? No. <gasps> Construct Pierce. Pierce is, a pre is precise with a charge shot that penetrates armor and enemies at any range. Okay, I don't have the source enough to get that. Nor do I have enough intrusive patterns or astral blips. But um, at least we know that we can get that. Uh, and I do have an ability point, but do I... Is there anything I... No, I can't afford anything right now. Um, I just... I mean, let's face it, I'm just... I'm going to keep upgrading launch, aren't I? Because it's the most fun thing in the entire world. But, um, yeah. Da, 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 da. Okay, yeah, we're getting there. Right. Here we go, parapsychology. Yes, that looks suspicious and bad. And it's F to change weapon form. And we've got... Okay, that's fine. Oh, yes. No, I remember. Do I remember this? Yes. Yes, this extremely unsettling thing was happening last time. Hello. Let's just... You know what? Yeah, everyone seems everyone seems pretty busy right now. Everyone's got their heads down. I'm just going to leave the desks here. I've said it before. I'll say it again. They are of a very poor construction. But, um... Hi, everyone. Good work. Keep it up. Just... I'm heading to parapsychology if anyone need needs me. Oh, platforming. Eh. That dash ability is so cool, but I could not be trusted with it in real life. What is that? Yes, well, yep, this all seems perfectly... This seems impossible and horrible. Yep, so... Let's just keep following the green lights, I guess. Hiya! Don't mind me. Just the director. Just coming through. What are these called? I can't remember. Uh, ah! Oh, hello! Right, you do mind me, however. Oh! <laughs> Take that. Hey! Oi, 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 oi! I didn't even see you. Ow! Oh, yeah, grenades. I remember now. And... Gonna... Bin you off. <gasps> I got an astral blip. Huh? Oh. Oh, I sort of regret doing that a little bit. Not loads, but oh god, I hope I didn't hit anyone. That I would regret. Yikes. Oh, a shelter. A shelter. Get me in there. Should I feel bad that I'm basically going into shelters to take their supplies and then leave? That's probably not what you're meant to do in a shelter, right? Uh, collectibles, case files, emergency call summary. Okay. Oh! Translates your transcript of a call to the California State Emergency Services. What's your emergency? Hello, hello, I'm here. Can you hear me? I can hear you, ma'am. Where are you? I'm, um, inside the wires. I'm lost. Ma'am, have you been drinking tonight? 
That's a strong follow-up question, isn't it? I feel like I'm stretching through the wire towards you. Don't hang up. I might go if you hang out. Go where? Go gone. Okay. Can you describe your surrounding? Oh, goodness. Dispatcher attempted to call the number back, but it was no longer in service. I bet that dispatcher slept really well that night. I bet they were absolutely fine. Pop! An intrusive pattern. Don't mind if I do. That isn't that is just the oddest location to put a toilet. Cause right, if anyone's sleeping on their side, firstly first thing they're gonna see on waking up is someone pooping. Secondly, while there is enough room to get a leg down here, it's not like so close to the wall that it's impossible to use said toilet, which I will admit is very clean, albeit lacking a seat. Someone opens the emergency supply storage. If someone goes in for like a tin of beans or a bedroll or something and then comes out, wham! Two broken knees. Awful. Just dreadful. And now no longer feel bad about taking everything of use from that room. Hello, friends. What's this way? Oh. Did I do this? I can't have been where I... No way did I throw that guard all the way over here. That can't have been me, right? Do I need to go somewhere else? No, I need to stay in the research sector, right? Yeah, let's just... Let's just keep going. Just in case. Pays to be thorough, doesn't it? Actually, how much am I getting paid as the director? Whoa. That is not something we've discussed. Dr. Darling's office. Ooh, lots to read and do in here. Astral plane. Dr. Ash was Dr. Darling's predecessor. Interesting. Bit of fun. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? That's a nice touch. And Old Newton's cradle. What's the deal with the head and muscles anyway? Oh boy. Hi. Darling, you drunk. Despite what you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. We're not tracking your movements or listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. <laughs> we do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. Think of them as a, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is um, classified. One day that classified not water might pour in and you'll be glad you got a, got an HRA keeping you afloat. And if you don't have an HRA, don't worry. It'll be uh, quick and painless. <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding. It won't I'm be making more. It won't be quick and painless or it will be quick and pa Oh man. I really feel for Dr. Darling. That was not reassuring. Can we sp These desks! I barely bumped it. I'm sorry. Somebody, like... Somebody clearly is important enough... Clearly important enough to merit such an enormous space. You'd think they'd give them a better desk. Right, can we spin this? Yeah. Straight over. Every time. Oh no, your post-it notes. Oh god, darling, I'm sorry. 
Astral Plane counter essay. Sure, I'll read an essay. That'll make for some good viewing. Da -da -da -da. Dr. Darling's insistent certain objects of power share a direct connection to the something. And then see your group of entities of blah, blah, blah. Mm -mm -mm. Hmm. Ooh, using the service weapon or the hotline will result in grievous harm or even death if the user is not the director or at least worthy of the role. Bit of fun. Good to know that when I held that gun to my head, we weren't playing around. <laughs> oh, it's just a crater again, isn't it? Eh. Okay, well, I feel like I've done enough damage here in Darling's office. We can leave that alone now. Ah! Oh, it's one of you, is it? They can fly now? Not really doing much, are you? Sort of floating there being distinctly annoying. Ow! Oh, I take that back. That was, in fact, quite painful. Oopsie. Oh, are you healing? Don't be healing. You're hard to... Yes. There we go. Well, he bounce. Well. Fun, fun, fun. Dimensional research. Why not? Yeah. All right, you got me. I do have a gun. Don't know how you work that out. Executive hiss note. Hold G to activate. Oh. Go to the communications department. Oh, what, what was that, Trench? This wallpaper is a lot. I like it, but I would never have it in my home. Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Just the same corridor I'm in. Okay. Reassuring. But... Well, at least that gum I like is going to come back in fashion. Back in style. Don't you mo Okay. So far, so good. I've activated a... Um, am I still going the right way? I've activated a bounty, but I don't know if I'm actually going the right way. Is this the way I came? What the fuck? This is the way I came. But now with more enemies again. Ow! Give me your blue bits. Right. Yes. Ow! I heard that coming, but I was not fast enough. Not going brilliantly for all Jesse Faden down here, is it? the fuck was that? That little zippy guy. Oh, 
Did I just throw... F I did. I just threw flowers at that guy. Oh, no. Not this again. Well. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. You're one of those super... Shieldy fellas, aren't you? Bye! Oh no, I'm out of power. Energy, whatever they call it. Cheese it! You can piss off and all. Yikes. I don't think it's ever thrown this many at me in such quick succession before. Give me a corpse. Okay, so... Ah! Oh, fuck! Oh my god, what were you? No! Absolutely not! Jesus fuck! Alright. No. I don't know what that was, I don't like it. But we've not been down here yet, so that's positive. <sighs> they were just hanging out in a tree! And I liked it not. Is this a control point? Can I cleanse this? Can I cleanse it? Hello. I'll raid you, whatever you are. Right. This looks promising. If horrible. Oh dear. No, keep climbing. Let's get as high up as we can get. Oh, tits. No, not E. Press F. You learned nothing from last week. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck. I am all thumbs today, apparently. Fuck, fuck, stop pressing E, you nitwit! Oh, maybe I can maybe I can zoom onto that bit. Yes, that makes sense. Now we press F, don't we, Jesse? Yes, we do. Pierce zoom boost. Ooh. I'll open my loadout, sure, why not? Oh, I don't have Pierce unlocked yet. Never mind. Got new mods, yes. Launch efficiency cost. That's not what I have equipped. Evade energy cost. Launch energy cost. Yada yada yada. Hmm. I'm fine. Okay. That leads that way. What's down here? Is there anything down here? Probably certain death. That looks certain deathy, doesn't it? Or does it? I don't think that's necessarily certain deathy. And any in any case, we've done it now, so we've got to keep going. This bit looks pretty bad. Uh, ooh, 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 treats. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Guess it. What do I get? Launch efficiency mod. Is it a good one? Because we've had launch efficiency mods before. No. Nah. Should probably deconstruct some of those for source, but. Okay. The pit. You see, like, maybe it's because I grew up, grew up like, watching Star Wars and stuff, um, and then I started playing fancy role-playing games and stuff. But like, I firmly believe nothing ever, nothing good ever comes from a place called the pit, like the Rancor pit. The pit of Carcoon, like the Sarlacc pit, pretty bad. All of the pits in in like D and D and stuff, they're just horrible, horrible fighting pits with like monsters in them. That pit in Game of Thrones with a bear in it, pits aren't good. Armpits, sometimes they smell. Oh, it's also a toilet with an arm and a leg in it. Can I just take the lift straight back up? No, of course I can't. 
you have to explore the pit. And the emergency light's not working. This I like not. Oh, this is good, though. Power cut. Restored the missing parts. Oh, thank you, by the way, to everyone who uh, explained to me some of the uh, idioms that Ati has been spouting. I now know that to throw the spoon in the corner is to die. So I was, there's me, look, covered in lichen. Uh, I was definitely not using that uh, that idiom correctly last time, was I? Um, but I've really, you know, aha, here we go. Okay, so the lift will work again now, that's good. But since we're here, we might as well continue to have a look around the pit. Yes, more treats. Another intrusive pattern. Great. We are closer to unlocking Pierce, who, as I understand it, is a weapon. Hello, what's all this then? I don't know what people will... Wow, we're getting so many of these treats. I don't know what employees had to do to get assigned down here. But uh, this is pretty grim. You can just imagine, can't you? All like the middle managers who demand respect. But don't realise that it's earned and not just given. Um, being like, you, you ship up, mister. Or you're going to be working in the pit. I'll put you in the pit so fast your pits will spin. Um, it looks like this is an elegant bit of design that's going to stop me from getting to that staircase. I'm pretty certain. It's going to test the theory. Oh, absolutely. Nah, Jessie Faden's not getting up there until she hits clearance level four. So let's just head back. Where's Marshall? Not in the pit. Oh, look. The desks here, at least, are well constructed. Ah, oh, looks like the pit's got its perks, actually. Darling's desk you could knock over with a strong breeze, but that is a sturdy piece of wood. Anyway, right. Boop. Up we go. Okie dokie. Where's this spat us out? Oh, back here. And we just didn't have to, because we came down the lift shaft and you went back up it in a lift, Johnny. <sighs> very good, very good. Okay, well, let's go this way then. Some sort of cafeteria. Psychology. Oh, is there just. A oh dear. Hiya! Wow, they look like they died in anguish. <gasps> That's not the head of security, is it? Looks like him. I mean, surely. Surely there would be a voice line if we just found his corpse. Oh, a shelter. Oh, they were so close. It's like seeing a skeleton next to an oasis. I have to say. Astral blip. Control, you are spoiling us today with the treats, which kind of makes me worry about uh, what's coming next. I bet it's not nice. Let's see what's in the lab. Let's see what's behind door number one. Okay, more treats. Don't like it. It stopped being fun and now it's just ominous. Making waves and diving under. Blah, blah. My dark disquiet singing such haunting melodies. So white, so still, so bright. It's almost too painful now. Lovely evanescence. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That looks to me like... Uh-oh. Hello, creepy chair. Oh, that's horrible and brilliant. Oh, that was genuinely unsettling. It's a perfectly silent room. See all these sound tiles here. And then... 
Oh. Oh. It's actually horrible. Let's see what happens if I whack this button. Back. Wait a minute. But those are the words from the there. Oh my god, they've got a recording studio. Is this Darling's EP or something? Oh no, wait, here's a classified file. Answer question. Did the song elicit any particular memories? If so, elaborate. Did you feel a strong emotion? If so, what emotion? Did a clear image of a weapon appear at your mind during the song? If so, elaborate. Provide a detailed description of your current surroundings as you see them. Have you ever heard the murmur of voices when no one is present? Please choose from one of the following pairs. One or two, A or B, day or night, apple or orange, burn out or fade away. Couldn't just have a normal recording studio, could we? Had to be something unsettling. The thing is, right, we started this episode at this control point, And then I did go and explore parakin parakinesiology... And that was quite useful because we found a lot of things that made me think that maybe there's a boss coming. And maybe we... Or maybe we can buy Pierce. Let's see. Can we do it yet? No. We've got enough intrusive patterns, but we need more source and we need more... One more astral blip. That's fine. But then also, come this way, and it's just made me think that... Have I spent this entire episode just going over a bit we already did last week? I think so, um, which is quite annoying. But hey-ho, we're back on track now, and I can always edit that bit down, so it doesn't have to be mega-mega long, but that's perfectly creepy. As is that. As is whatever this is. It looks like Bes Bispin, the city in the clouds. Don't know why I'm referencing Star Wars so much. Astral Exhibition, eh? Flexibles. Astral Exhibition. It was originally built for the Astral Nauts to use as a training location. Mm hmm. So I just repurpose the space, similar to how zoos hope familiar surroundings will affect the well being of the animals. We hope to observe the redacted's behavior in an environment similar to its home dimension. So far, it just breaks everything we put in it. But Rome wasn't built in a day. Well, I'm a thing that can be put in things. I, I smell a boss encounter. That's what I smell. I smell a boss encounter. Yep. Okay. Sure, I'll press this. Oh, great. It's feeding time at the zoo. Also, uh, hopefully that effect won't continue, but um, possible flashing images warning. If there are flashing images, I'm going to uh, put a big old warning on the front of this episode. Just to be certain, but... Um, yes, there we go. Alright, you look... Very unfriendly, and all, I'm going to assume you're invulnerable. But, hello, where there are batteries, there are escape routes. Escape route, please. Hello. Oh, shite. Are you going to follow me? Hello, hello, hello. Uh, 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 oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Press, press button. Trap terrifying thing. Ah, oh, crap, it's there. Okay. So perhaps if I can... Hello! Absolutely hoon it. Oh, if I trap it in here with me... Hello! Hello, I'm right here, look! Mmm, delicious Jesse Faden. Oh, crap! Oh, no, wait, that's good. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Is it? Is it? I don't know. Let's just hope it hasn't moved. Stay there, stay there, stay there. That was 
was all right. I was horrible. Ah, Marshall, eh? Just who I've been looking for. Sorry if you can hear construction noise outside, by the way. Like that. We're so close. We need to hurry. Okay. Right. Whoa. Oh, I feel very powerful in that. His clusters heal other enemies. His clusters can eat my chair. That his cluster doesn't heal other enemies. That his cluster heals dick all. I'm not sure any single one of them has shot back so far. <laughs> Perfect timing. Right, you. Come here and grenade that to my face. Good shot, Johnny. Very good. Ow! Ow, ow, ow. Ow, ow, ow. Who's, who's throwing that? Oh, it's you. I'm going to consult my notes to see what those are meant to be called, because I do not like them. I have to say, right, last week was all, you know, one big power trip, and I felt super capable. Um, and yet, this game keeps finding ways to show me unsettling enemies and make fights feel a bit different and just a bit horrible. It's really quite impressive. Because oftentimes you're playing a video game and the um, the sense of the new wears off a little bit and the sense of menace just, you know, it's that's a hard thing to maintain over the course of however many hours. Um, and yet, in a format where I'm deliberately just running my mouth and saying stupid things and kind of lovingly taking the piss out of this game, I still find it still finds ways to quite genuinely unsettle me. Ah, need to heal, need to heal, need to run. Need to heal, need to run. Please give me your healing bits. Thank you. Pop, pop, pop. Shit. We're getting a bit quicker at doing that, at least. Neutralizing those grenades. Whoop. Jolly good. Ah, oh, control point. Let us cleanse it. Oof. 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 So long, cooler architecture. Hello, drab and comforting workplace. Good. Okay, I'll be right there with you. I'm just gonna look for any groupthink. What is group think? Hmm. Telepathy, telepathy, etc., etc. By the way, I know. Oh yeah, what have we got? His cluster. Hmm. Manifestations. Yes, horrible. <laughs> his elevated. His guard. His ranger. His sniper. Mission impressions. What about the? <laughs> Excuse me. What about the ones who fly around in chairs? Tell me about those, please. Unread, too. His cluster. His initial impression. Okay, fine. Um, by the way, I've, I've had some messages from people saying that I should really be watching the full clips from Trench. Um, ooh, a new mission. A little side mission after we talk to Marshall. How about that? Oh, yeah. Do we... Nothing to build. Can we afford Pierce? Yes, we can. Okay, and then weapon forms. Weapon forms. Interfit. I don't want to upgrade. Oh, I've got to change up my loadout, haven't I? Silly. Um, 
Okay, we're using spin quite a lot, so we'll keep spin for now. Let's go for pierce. And we've got mods for pierce. Zoom boost, that sounds pretty good. Consecutive kills boost, accuracy boost, low health boost. Zoom boost. Oh wow. Doesn't feel like my cup of tea, but I will try it for the sake of things. What are we talking about? Oh yeah, trench. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm aware that I should be watching those. I might watch some of those sort of between episodes just to, uh, to sort of get my understanding of the story up. I'll probably record it for safety just in case there's anything that everyone absolutely needs to share in. I know it does round out the story a lot more, so uh, thank you for bringing that to my attention. Marshall, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Jesse Faden. I'm the director. I'm to help. Faden? Hold on. Yes. I'm setting the elevator for you. We need to talk. You got that right. So, um, it's probably the intercom, but Marshall sounds like their skull has a load of bees in it. Ah, oh, crap. My least favourite ones. Um, really not sure about this whole spin weapon deal right now. Not spin. Pierce. Ah! Fuck! I mean, against my least favourite enemies, probably not the best way to, to uh, first try it. But yeah, that wasn't nice. Okay, well, we got through it. They died. Hmm. I mean, it, that looks very Lilac Wars, doesn't it? Or um, Star Fox 64, if you are... Uh, not from the UK. Jesse Faden's in a lift. Let's go see Marshall. Do 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 do. Hello. Thank you, the Luck Lab. I really hope you get breaks, because if you have to guard this lift with this going on all the time, that's just not fun for anybody. But I'm glad that you're properly kitted out. You've got your HRAs. You've got your walkie-talkie hats. Oh, hello. <gasps> Polaris, yes. I will can claim this control point. Anything upgradey? No. Still nothing. Oh yeah, board countermeasures. Someone told me to check that out as well. Pierce maneuvers. Kill enemies with a service weapon in pierce mode. Sure, I can do that. And I'll get a weapon mod. Spin maneuvers. I've got spin. I can do that as well. Kill enemies in the executive sector. Sure, I'll take that on. Kill enemies with a service weapon in charge mode. I don't think we have that yet, so... Kill guards in the executive sector using spin. Specific not found. You are proof. Oh, can I only do three at a time? Yes, it looks that way. Okay, well, that's fine. Mmm, challenges. <gasps> I love these things. We've actually got one at home in, in my kitchen. I'm like a waving cat. That is very slow moving. And slightly unsettling. Oh, hey, sorry. Hi. Oh, you do get breaks. They don't look like fun breaks, but at least you get breaks. Starting to think that maybe I'm not running the best bureau here. Did I just... New bureau, like major targets. Let's have a look. Oh, in executive. Okay. Let's have a look. Missions. Except major goes to pneumatics. I really just want to, I like, these seem cool, but I really want to crack on with the the main story, if I'm perfectly honest. Hello, Marshall. Congratulations on your appointment, Director Faden. I'm Helen Marshall, head of Bureau Operations. I love that coat. Zachariah's dead then, and I assume you found his gun. I did. Just call me Jesse. Trench told me to find you. He said you could help. 
And he told you this through the hotline. Makes sense. None of this phases her? Really? She's, look at her, she's a badass. Here's the situation. Darling created the HRAs in a lab nearby. We need more if we're gonna survive this attack. My rangers can't secure the lab alone, not against those things. We need more firepower. At least she seems to know what's going on here. She could know about Dylan. She from Boston? I can clear out the hiss. I'll be your firepower. That's a good answer. Is she testing me? Darling has systems in place to protect his labs. This should help you get past them. We'll talk more after you clear out the hiss. Big fan of Marshall already. Big fan. That's fine. That's not a problem. I'm the director! I mean, yeah, in fairness, you don't want to risk a breach. And, uh... This doesn't look good. I see rangers over there. Womp! Really, really, really trying to aim this gun, Control. Thank you so much, though. Okay, that's that sorted. I'm getting on with Pierce. I mean, it's it's effective. You've got to give it that. Womp! Womp! Ow! Come here. Ow! It's not my favourite gun. I think once I've done the... Um, Ow, little bounty doodah. I'm going to swap it out. Go back to the old shotgun. Ha! Kill enemies with service weapon in spin mode. I'd be delighted. Who are you shooting at? Oh. At whom are you shooting? Oh, you stole my kill. I mean, it was the right thing to do tactically, but... Look out, Ranger! Ranger? Yeah. Oh! I just got somebody killed. And not like in the you tried to cure them of the hiss and they disappeared way that we had in episode one. I straight up just got someone killed there. More than one. Oh, I'm a bad director. I am a bad director. Yep. Yep, cleanse, please. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Parakinesiology Chief Lewis. Come on, buddy. Ow. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Go, go, go. Go. Eat your blue bits. Who said your shield could recharge so fast? No, we don't like that at all, actually. Right, where are you? I want to hit you with one of your mates. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, great. Speaking of mates... Come here. Yes! Ow! Oh, that was catastrophic. And we run away from Chief Lewis. And we find something to throw at Chief Lewis. We shoot Chief Lewis. Damn it, his shield's up again. Mm-mm. We die to Chief Lewis? Question mark. Stop putting your shield up, you bastard. Fuck. We die to Chief Lewis. Ow. 
That was profoundly painful. I don't remember him doing this whirling shield of stuff before. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. Oh, that's why his shield keeps coming up and going down, I guess. Okay. Oh, right. So I can save my ammo, really, as long as I can dodge at the right time. There we go, because he drops it. You shoot at him. He throws the thing. You die. You develop the strategy. You go again. You get past the boss. You play a bit more. You thank everybody for watching. You close it out. You edit it. You publish it. You put it up on YouTube. We've got a plan, everybody. Watch his projectiles, screamed the guard. It's good advice. You gotta admit it, it's good advice. Ow, it is gonna hurt. You're right. Run away. Run away. Do I have anything to heal with? Or with which to heal? No. Might die. Saw that one coming at least. Yeah, there's no point throwing anything at that point. Okay. Whoa, that was close. Okay. Right, he's not throwing anything, he's not throwing anything. Wait, they're more bad guys? Oh, these are bad guys. Oh, I can I can eat their health. Yes. Eyes on the prize though, Faden. Damn. Ah, oh, I need to watch him more closely. I got too obsessed with getting health back. Okay. Hiding behind pillars. It's our friend, again. It helped us last time, it'll help us this time. And the drums seem to slow. Or maybe that's a coincidence. When he's getting ready to lob something. Okay. Ooh, more blue bits, blue bits, blue bits. Don't get too close. Okay. Go, go, go. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Yes! And we got an intrusive pattern. Damn, missed the window. There we go, there we go, there we go. Hit him! Yes! You are dead now. Thanks. Kill the grunts. Whoop. Cleanse the control point. Ugh. We got there in the end. Third try? Third try. Not too bad. Right, do we have... Still just one point, but board countermeasures. Pierce maneuvers. Yeah, I wanted to do that. Oh, collect reward. Oh, I did do it. Oh, great. <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, no. I just abandoned one. I abandoned one when I was on 9 out of 10. That's really annoying. God damn it. That's really annoying. Oh, the board of directors is very funny. Piss guards, they are minor threats. Squash slash tell off them. Sure, I'll accept that one. Oh, man. Kill enemies without dying. 50. You are needed slash irreplaceable slash irreplaceable. Okay, I'll take that one as well. <sighs> okay, well... 
Onwards to Darling's HRA lab, I suppose. Ritual office there. And what's this way? Protective studies. Is this the way we came in, though? No. Okay. Go through there in a sec. I just want to see what's what's in the ritual office, if anything. Oh. It's a lift. And it leads to... Oh, Christ. Okay. Well, we're just... I was hoping it would bring up the menu, but... Oh, we took this lift. Didn't we? Does it lead to Marshall? No. Carla. File received. Thank you for this blah. This is a nice office. Dingy, but it's nice. It's nicer than the pit, anyway. <clears throat> All right, well, thank you, Ritual Office. That was diverting. Let's go find Darling's HRA lab. So many directions. All of them ominous. Okay. Oh, cool. You must like these HRAs. Sounds like Darling built them. And most of the things around here. If Marshall can't help us with Dylan, he's our next best bet. Assuming he's not. Or still hammered, because the last time we saw him, he was drunk. Do a little crouch. Oh, no. Whoopsie. Do a little jump. Why are we allowed in here? I mean, with the director, obviously we're allowed in, but... What's... Is there anything in this area for us? Yeah! Sneaky, sneaky little treat chest. Give me your secrets. Intrusive pattern. Lovely. Oh, I like this game. It is stylish. What is this? A puzzle? Oh, that's annoying. Nearly. There we go. That was fun. <gasps> it's the HRA lab. You let me hear. Any idea how to make it work? Too powerful for our use. Feedback loop. Interesting. Hello again, Director. It appears what? we have a new problem. We need to get the HRA machine working. I've replaced a couple of spark plugs, but this looks a bit more complicated. Darling must have had a system. Randomness isn't in his nature. The punch cards, the symbols, the terminals. How do they connect? I'll see what I can do. <sighs> that really threw me then when Marshall came in. It's like, we have a problem. It's like, uh, 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 am I the problem? That is a very large gun. Okay, punch card. And... Don't know what this is. Or this. But these seem to be terminals. And there are four cables. That means we've got four of them. So we presumably need four punch cards. That's three. 
Aha! 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 Okay. Now. This board. So, we need to find all the punch cards. Yes. Those two... I mean, these two form a, a happy smiley face. So that's a good start. Darling must have liked those. What is this? Black rock prisms. Black rock prisms are unique formations of black rock, distinct in both their shape and potency. While the density of black rock dampens paranatural forces, the unique redacted structure of prisms retain frequencies in the range redacted to redacted hertz with perfect redacted harmonization. The report analyzes the results of focusing a redacted through a harmonized prism onto a redacted. Methods for the imprinting of non-physical fields onto redacted, imbuing them with the properties of the harmonized resonance redacted in the prism will be explored and explained. Refer to file redacted for full report. Well, I guess that's the thing that's on the HRA machine. Now, restart the punch card terminals. Okay, let's just let's just start dicking around with these. I don't see any other punch cards here. Beep! Okay. Oh, I'm missing one. Apparently. But Have you checked the be? upper floor? Thank you, Marshall. I didn't check the upper floor. That was well timed. So often in games, the NPCs would be like, Maybe we should check the upper floor. Maybe we should check the upper floor. And it's so relentless, it's maddening. Okay, four. Okay, so we've got five. These symbols. Can we affect this? Configurations. Okay. Let's see what we've got. See if any of these match. It should correspond to a terminal. I was just praising your dialogue there, Marshall. Don't get ideas. Okay, so it's either that sort of umbrella looking y thing or that one. With the. Okay. So we've got the umbrella -y looking thing. Let's try that. Whoops. Stacked it. Okay. And then what have we got here? Sort of. Just going on a theory at this point, but. These whiteboard drawings may be important. Shut up, Marshall. I was praising you. I was praising you. Oh, but look, there's an arrow swapping these. So should, in fact, this one, if this one is three, be... Oh, that one anyway. <laughs> well, I don't have this guy. Gonna try some stuff. I'm just gonna throw some stuff in. Why not? Let's do it. What's it gonna do? Kill me? Maybe. It looks like he was working on something to do with these symbols. Marshall, I will turn you upside down and shake you until your lunch money falls out. So help me. Have I done one for this one? No. Let's do that. Why not? Yeah, sure. Okay. Beep boop. Mac. <laughs> okay. Cool. That's fine. It's not happy. Let's take all these back. Do some process of elimination stuff. What Let's go get the one. From... Shut up, Marshall. Let's go back upstairs. Okie dokie. So, what's crossed out on this one? The, some of these are identical. Configurations. Okay, configurations. So, you've got this umbrella looking one in the first position. And we've got this squarey looking one in the fourth position. And this is machine number four. So does that mean we put this one here? Is that even the right symbol? 
Yes, it is. Okay, just shows up negative. On the other. And the number one position there is the umbrella -y thing. But then there's no telling that that board is the actual master one because all of these are different. But where's machine number one? Five. Try different combinations. Shut one up. Of them has to work. Ah. So this is number one. Okay. Two and three, it reckons, are the big square and just the the sort of sidey square. But those have been swapped. So the big blocky one should be a number two. Like that. Which would put sidey square here, which would put this one by process of elimination there. Done it! Darn it. Cool, cool, cool. And it only took 15 prompts from Marshall. <laughs> ah. The prism shattered. Dominic's yes. Prototypes have a lot of issues. We I'll say. Plan. Okay. What's the new plan, Marshall? We need more black rock prisms to make this machine work. Okay. Darling has another lab down in the black rock processing site and maintenance. That must be where he keeps the prisms. I've been to maintenance already. Mm -hmm. I can find my way. But how long will that take? Nothing here is simple. I need to ask her now, before I go. I need something from you first. What do you know about Dylan Faden? I knew this was coming. Mm -hmm. Lives are at stake here, and we need this machine working to save those lives. Once that is done, Director Faden, then we can talk. She's right. As much as I don't want to admit it, I'm the only one who can help. Fine. I'll get the prisms first. Dylan will have to wait just a little longer. How much but longer? Don't call me, Director. Okay. Jesse is fine. Mm -hmm. Call me the I'll Director. I'll call you Faden. Here, you'll need this key card. Thanks. Clearance Emily Pope will set up a base and executive. Once I have the prism, I'll meet you there. Right. I'll move out immediately. And keep an eye out for Darling. Finding him might be the key to stopping the hiss. It's just one large scale HRA. It's there now. We are about to be exposed to a different kind of resonance. Hostile, viral, invasive resonance. I think that's, that's what the Hedron resonance amplifiers are for. Taking the protection Hedron can provide us and keeping us from being wiped out. This will lead back to central research. Right. Well, I think that is a pretty darn good place to uh, to stop for this week, and uh, and to call an end to this episode of, of Press Any Kiadini. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. I had a great time because I really like this game, and uh, I feel like we made progress. We did some puzzle. We unlocked a gun I don't like. Uh, I faffed around going the wrong way for a while. Uh, we advance the story. All in all, a good day's work here at the Federal Bureau of Control. But um, yeah, as I say, uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, there there are quite a few more now on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. Um, you should check them out. Um, make sure you subscribe, ring the bell icon, all that good stuff. Uh, if you haven't already checked out the Patreon, you can go to patreon.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. Um, your support really does mean the earth and it means I can keep doing stuff like this. And all the other stuff that I get to do via Patreon. So, uh, yeah, thank you very much. Um, to take a load off. We worked hard today. 
I feel like we really we really made progress. So um, good job, everybody, and I'll I'll see you next week. So long. <laughs>